And Marley, it is very much a growing threat, an escalating threat. Three of these armed robberies in just the past week alone. LAPD, as you point out, working quickly to try to see if all three of these are tied together. They're happening in pretty much the very same area, the same neighborhood, pretty much, all with the very same MO, gunmen pointing a pistol, demanding money. And now that threat has left the vendors and even the customers very concerned. Watch. Friday night with the taco stands, all hoping for a busy night and especially now a safe night. It's viciously scary, and I'm asking everybody if you know anything, please report it because, man, it's keeping everybody in the house, man. Kids, grown up. Keeping everybody inside, he says, as customers are now the latest target, along with the food vendors themselves, in an escalating series of armed robberies. Three in just the past week, two in just the past day, all hitting taco trucks and taco stands. He says they showed him the pistol and said, hand me the money. He's one of the vendors at the taco stands, robbed at gunpoint around midnight. One in Compton and the other in the Green Meadows area of South L.A., all just about an hour apart. The M.O. of these armed robberies all the same, even from the taco truck that's hit a few blocks away last Memorial Day weekend. That armed robbery goes down in front of security cameras that brings this video, again, a pistol to the victim's head. All the money stolen at gunpoint. But in the last two armed robberies, it is now the customers turned victims. When I heard that he was like, asking for the money, I started like, reaching for my bag over here. Yeah. Take it off, and I did, that's when he looked at me. And I don't know what he assumed that I had, but like, I, that's when the hand hand went there for hour. For now, the vendors have no choice. They have to keep on cooking just to make a living, despite the growing safety threat that now is even striking the customers. And that's the biggest thing to change everything around here. They also robbing the customers. So you guys, we all in this together. Please, somebody talk whatever they see. And now, lie, that pretty much sums up the talk right on the streets. The feeling is that a lot of folks in those neighborhoods know what's going on, but they're afraid to say anything, afraid for their own safety. Can't blame them there. But their hope continues to be with LAPD, with more patrols in the area. They'll make a quick arrest and ease all the concern. For now, we're live here downtown L.A. Back to Marley you go.